The sacrifice of those who gave their blood for the language was not in vain, said Prime Minister. By polls to Chittagong A to on April 27, voting will be done in EVM, says Election Commission Secretary. BNP is the main sponsor of those who put a violent camp on a Bengal language, says Information Minister. Eviction drive of the NCC on Ansul Hawk Road in Tejgar repeated irregularities are sad, says Mayor Assalamu alaikum, welcome to my TV news. I'm Farhan Yasmin with your news today. Watching headlines now, the details. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina said that the sacrifice of those who gave their blood for the language was not in vain. She said Awam Malik was the first to declare February 21st as a mattress day. The Premier said this in the afternoon at Bangabundu Conference Centre on International Mother Language Day. The Prime Minister said that there is no difficulty in learning another language but importance should be given to a mother tongue education. Stating that the father of the nation was a vocal in all the hesitations, the Prime Minister said that if Bongabondo's unfinished autobiography had not been written, the name of the father of the nation would have been erased from the language movement. By election to the Chittagong 8 constituency, a left vacant following the date of Awam Malik MP Muslim Uddin Ahmed will be held on April 27 this year. Election Commission Secretary Jahangir Alam announced the schedule of the by election today. According to the schedule, the last day to offer submitting nomination paper is March 27, while the date for scrutinizing a nomination paper is March 29, and the last date of withdrawal of candidature is April 5. Voting will start at 8 a.m., and the election will be held in EVMs there will be no CC cameras in the polling station and will continue till 4 p.m. Muslim Uddin, a freedom fighter and also president of Chittagong, saw the unit of our Malik breath as it last at Evercare Hospital in Dhaka on February 6 and he was 75. BNP is the main sponsor of those who put a violent camp on Bengali language, says Information Minister Dr. Hassan Mahmoud. He said this in an event at the National Press Club today. The Information Minister said that all the evil forces who want to destroy the language he have taken refuse under the shadow of BNP. He said that the government is trying its best to make Bengali the official language of the United Nations. Dhaka North Mayor Atikul Islam said that the city corporation will hold a meeting with the stakeholders on March 1 regarding illegal parking on the road. He said this while conducting an illegal eviction drive on Anisur Hawk Road in Tejika. He also said that a five member investigation committee has been formed to prevent illegal encroachment on the road. The mayor said after the operation, the truck occupied the road again, which is unfortunate. The mayor also said that whatever needs to be done to keep the roads clean will be done. The High Court gave 14 suggestions to the Ministry of Commerce to amend the current company law of the country and make a new law and resolve dispute related to the ownership of private and public limited company. Justice Muhammad Ashraful Kalam's only High Court judgment has given this suggestion along with the observation. Observing the adjustment, the court said that the current Companies Act 1994 is an enforceable in the many cases and although it is called the Companies Act 1994 it is actually the Companies Act 1913. In this situation to take bondage to the level of a developed country the 109 year old company law must be radically changed. The verdict which was announced on August 25 last year was published on the Supreme Court's website today. 
The counterterrorism unit has arrested Amir Sheikh Mohammad Mohibul Naib of Jamaatul Ansar Fil Hindish Sharkia, an extremist military organization. The head of the organization said in a press conference at DNP Media Center at noon. Afzal Jaman said that uh, this new organization, Yatra, is a part of Harkatul Jihad whose army Ruxi plans to expand the organization while sitting in jail. Mohibullah was engaged in a training and pitching new members of the organization. The so-called Hizras were a trained and sent to the hilly regions. At least three people were killed in a road accident on the Chatpur Kumela Regional Highway at Gosharhat of Chatpur Shodhupochala. The accident happened in the morning today. Locals say that the bus was heading towards Kumila from Chatpur when it collided at head on with a CNG run auto rickshaw coming from the opposite direction. Among the four passengers, three succumbed to their injuries. Locals rescued an injured person and took him to Chatpur Shodhur Hospital. Chatpur Motor Police Station Osi Abdur say that the bus injury has been seized. We are about to the end of the headlines once again. The sacrifice of those who gave their blood for the language was not vain, said Prime Minister. By polls to Chittagang 8 on April 27, voting will be done in EVM, says Election Commission Secretary. BNP is the main sponsor of those who put a violent camp clamp on the Bengal language, says Information Minister. Eviction drive of DNCC on Aninsul Hawk Road in Tesga repeated irregularities are set, says Miratik. Chinese President Xi Jinping will visit Russia next month. Moscow will not win the war, says Biden. Putin threatens to test nuclear weapons. World Cup plans after England series, says Hathwa Singh, taking chairs as the head coach of the Bangladesh team for the second term. Thanks for being with us to join with MyTV News on YouTube slash MyTV BD News to watch all our programs on YouTube slash MyTV Bangla, Facebook slash MyTV Bangla. Our next report will be taken at 7.30 p.m. Stay connected and all our friends.